Hello and what is happening everybody? We are finally here. After a very long and unnecessarily amount of time, I have finally made it to the season seven finale. That's right, I will be closing the book on 2017 and ringing in 2018 with episodes 25 and 26 shadow play. And I should be used to it now, but that still just blows my mind. Seven full seasons done and more on the way. Seven years of a single generation of one show and I've been here with you for five years of it. I should be used to it by now, but I'm just not. And that is a very, very good thing. But enough spraying brain matter in every single direction. I'm gonna try to bring all that back together because we are here today for the My Little Pony Friendship is Magic Season 7 Finale, Episodes 25 and 26 Shadow Play Parts 1 and 2. So without wasting any more time, why don't we go ahead and get started. And we are back and starting out with the book. Elements that elements looks like the book that was on top of uh, Some Versus Barrel. And the, uh, I know Uncommon Bond. Who represent them all. Strength. I like the narrator. Healing. Beauty. Hey, these are all the uh, legends source. from the main six of stories. Myself and these pillars of I don't know if we got a Star Scrolls, but uh, we all know it's Twilight. To maintain and share the light of these powerful ideas. This one dude was able to but know who these guys were. to believe the pony who brought us together only wanted that power. Oh, that's himself. never happened before. Cast out and alone, this power-mad pony turned to darkness. <laughs> and we turned our backs on him. Thirst. Transformed into a pony of shadows, he returned Oh, that's new. To extinguish the I also like how we're ending season seven, how season one started, in a book. To stop him. The pillars and I must make a brave sacrifice. But we shall leave go? behind a seed in hopes that one day it will grow into a force to stand against the darkness for all time. We must oh, it's the Tree of Harmony. Fear. That's where the sucker came the from. Only plan we have. I only oh, Sunburst, how are you doing that enough. voice? That's the last entry. And maybe Star Swirl's final words before he vanished. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Luna looks like she got way worse news than that. My little pony. My little pony. My little pony. He used to wonder what friendship could be. My little pony. And T-Roll shed its magic with me. Big adventure, tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness is an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete. You have mine. Did you know you're all my very best friends? No, oh, that was lovely. I've always Hi, wondered what happened to Star again. Swirl. This is quite a discovery, Sunburst. So, you're welcome. Genuine, you can verify that this journal really belonged to Star Swirl the Bearded? <laughs> Wing Flutter, Indeed. put those away. From the looks of it, the last thing he wrote before facing the Pony of Shadows... But who could really tell? So, the Pony of Shadows was really real? Yes. It appears so. We never met the other pillars, and we were too young to understand the danger they faced. Where's that flashback? Hold on a second now. Hey. All those legendary ponies were real too, and they went off with Star Swirl to face the Pony of Shadows. Including your stories. None of them were ever heard from again. Nope. <laughs> yeah. Weren't you listening? Apparently not. But what happened to them all? They must have defeated the villain, since Equestria is still full of light and hope. True. But how? And where did they go? My old I'm sure we're going to find out. Rusty. But I wonder if old the answers tarnish. can be found somewhere within the pages of this book. Well, I just happen to be an expert in old ponies. Of course you I are. I mean, I practically memorized every ancient text about Star Swirl there is. Yes. Seriously. All <laughs> Seriously. We have all. fond memories of our old teacher. If you could discover what happened to him... We would be most grateful. Of course. It'd be great. Nice catch. Solving a thousands year old mystery could take forever. Or the Twilight research, can do it in a night. The re-reading. The re-re-reading. Calm your horn. The bump. You might find you need help. Maybe. Luckily, she's got Maybe. a whole bushel of helpers right here. Best research oh, team ever. Uh, how long will all this research take exactly? Many moons. Let's get this back to my library. I'm sure we'll figure out what happened in no time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's go. Research party. Well, there goes one. Uh, figure it out yet, Twilight? 
How's that eraser taste? Oh, forget one, there's like 50. Hi, Sunburst. You figured something out? <laughs> Wait, rare it with a cupcake. Nothing. I mean, Star Swirl was a genius, obviously. But forget old Ponish. There's parts where his horn writing is like another language. Uh, I'd have a hard time writing with my horn, too. Twilight, we've been studying and referencing and cross referencing cross -eyed. for three days straight. Oh, there goes my one night theory. I haven't spent this much time reading since the last Daring Do book came out. Took you three nights to do that? to take a break. This mystery is over a thousand years old after all. Another day or two won't make a difference. Mm. Two days? I don't want to waste two seconds. Of course not. Can't do that. I'm close to an answer. I can feel it. Here's In what? Say Ponehenge. Oh. What's that? <laughs> the Temple of Ponehenge? You okay. Read that? We should have given it to Starlight uh, from the start. Pretty sloppy, but it's nowhere near as bad as mine. Tawar Dal Grimlik of Fact. Ola if someone's handwriting is just a slightly better than yours, you can read it. At the base of Full Mountain. Full Mountain? Sounds like a dangerous place. Our last stand. <sighs> well, that sure sounds like a clue to me. Thank you, Spike. Thanks for the input. Ponehenge. Is it Ponehenge? I'm I gonna take us to get here. I've never seen magical runes like these before. Have you? Uh -oh. How long has this place been here? We've never been here. I don't think any pony's seen any of this for a long time. Nope. Hey, quit disrupting the site. It'd take a whole team <laughs> of ponies to clear she away looks all happy. this brush. Way to go, Fluttershy. Uh, fail. Sure we find out what happened here over a thousand years ago. Uh, you're right. I suppose it was a long shot. Cheer up, Twilight. Finding a whole set of ancient ruins is pretty impressive. She doesn't well, look very happy about it. On it. I guess I hoped we'd get here and the mystery would just magically be explained. It's gonna be magically explained. There we go. That's freaking convenient. Uh, Twilight. <gasps> Back up. Oh, look who it is! We got st Star Swirl. I, I Hi. My whole life. I can't believe you're here. I don't think you can communicate with it. I don't think he is here. Nope. I don't think any of them are. Hi, guys. How'd you know he was there? Nice to meet you, Shadow. Did your shield protect against shadows, too? So they all had their items when they disappeared. How come the items are still here? And he's not on his pillar anymore. You will never defeat me. We did not come here to defeat you. No. Extinguish the dark. We came to contain you. That's the difference. Well, well, that, well, that explains it. <laughs> Kinda. Well, if they, even if they went with it, it's still well, defeating them, kind of, sort of, maybe. And you got it! Woohoo! Uh, what just happened? A magical explanation? Like Star Swirl cast a spell that banished the Pony of Shadows. Of course! Powerful magic like just that realizing this? impression on this place. Bringing the book back here let us see what happened. Which was what? Star Swirl and the rest of the pillars sacrificed themselves to save Equestria. Yep. Oh, hey, it's look, it's Lyran Bomb on it. Chilling on the Equestria roadside. was solved with a musty old book from an antique shop. I don't think it's I solved. The mystery's solved. Thank Star you, Sunburst. Was one of the most powerful oh. feats of magic in all of history. 
It'll take years of study before we fully understand it. I think I understand Star Swirl's spell. There's the one night thing I was talking about. I know I finished one of Star Swirl's spells before. Get two but wings this away. One was on a whole different level. Was it an explosion of magical feedback? An evocation? A kind of incantation? It's Star Swirl. All of the above. Are endless. And once Starlight set me on the right track with his crazy horn riding. Good job, <laughs> I mean, Starlight. A genius, so I guess we can forgive <laughs> a little messiness. Princess I Snort. Journal again, and it's amazing. Get it out of my Quiet, face. Darling, we understand you're excited, but that's all we understand. Indeed. What exactly is so amazing? Only how Star Swirl and the other pillars sent the Pony of Shadows to limbo. That's where they went. What now? The realm between realms. Oh, nice. They used their magic to <laughs> open a portal between worlds to Limbo and pulled the Pony of Shadows inside. Darling, oh. your diorama! That's what you're worried about more? here? Oh, pfft, never mind. Star Swirl thought the only way to trap the Pony of Shadows in Limbo was for the Pillars to take him there. So they got stuck too! The Pony One way in, no way out. Have been really awful for them to do that. Need a blanket there, Fluttershy? I being trapped for all time with a super duper bad guy in Limbo might be okay if you were doing the Limbo. <laughs> but that's still pushing it. But what were they doing with the bad guy there? I think I can get them out. Oh, dear. Twilight, are you serious? You can save the most legendary ponies of all time? I don't know. But keep the bad the guy there. Between worlds didn't work out well for me. <laughs> Are you sure we keep coming back to this. <laughs> First of all, you opened portals through time. And second of all, Star Swirl wrote the spell you used to do it. If he'd been here, he could have stopped it. Oh, of course. Star would be safer with him in it. We have to save him. But you'd be saving all the pillars, right? And they disappeared ages ago. That's the thing about Limbo. It isn't one place or another. No. Nope. It's in between. So time stands still. So if they're not doing nothing. Out, it'll be like they never left. I actually built another Dash model Dash is still super bored. <laughs> what can we do to help? If I'm right, we need to find items that are connected to the pillars in some way. You mean like stuff that belonged to them? How would like the stuff you saw for? at Pwnhenge. Or where? Luckily, Star Swirl took a lot of notes. My compatriots Did you not read this full book before we started? Hail from every corner of our land, bringing with them artifacts and talismans of great power. Um, Twilight, what are you doing? I'm not doing anything. Keep reading the maps, listening. Rock hoof shovel. Flash Magnus' shield. Miss Main's flower. Let's take a wild guess at who's going for which artifact. I guess we don't need to figure out who should get what. No, we don't. It's kind of obvious. <laughs> oh, hey, it's Petunia! We haven't seen her since he first was introduced. Legends don't wear helmets. This belonged to a real pony. What do you know? I can guarantee Rock Hook was as real as you and me. <laughs> and I suppose that ravine was dug with his trusty shovel. I don't know, but you can go jump in that ravine. Volcano. Probably. I love old legends as much as any pony. That dude but back there's gonna break his teeth. To save a village from rushing lava with a shovel is preposterous. Oh, freaking! Never mind. He's just gonna crush Applejack. Or not. A little exaggerated, but okay. I can't believe you just did that. You saved us. It was preposterous, I wasn't bet it? If you told some pony else the story, it might sound <gasps> preposterous. Yeah, get her, AJ. Um, I uncovered a hole. Can you go in there? I suppose some stories might be true. Hey, look, it's the shovel. Beat up, but it's a shovel. The rock hoofs appears to be one of them. Who did the tapestry behind it? It's still be Oh, jeez. You keep those wolves to yourself, dear. <laughs> this smacker with a trowel? This has been in my Ow. family for generations. And I'm not about to let some whippersnapper take the last good piece of it. Well, you're not going to have a choice. Who came from far and wide to see these gardens. But Why? But flower's the only worthwhile thing left. So it was beautiful. It went to crap. The legend... Miss Bane. Sorry. Beautified it and then went to crap again? 
And then rarity happened. Perhaps it just seemed like your gardens were worthless, but a little pruning can work wonders. No, of course, a little. You have to look after more than just one flower now. You've given me back my family's legacy. The flower you wanted seems like a fair trade for that. That was easy. I, I can't believe Flash Magnus's shield ended up in the Dragon Lands. Ooh, this might not be so Good easy. Thing you brought the official equestrian friendship ambassador to the dragons to help you navigate Bye. our customs. Like our That's not gonna work out well. I'd say that looks very dangerous with the dragon, so it's, no, it's equivalent to ponies and snow. That was awesome! Yes. Dragon Lord Ember commanded us to make peace with ponies, but it doesn't mean you can surf in our spot. Locals only, dude. As the official equestrian friendship ambassador to the dragons, I have to say... Is that an official title? Not very friendly. Well, what do you know? Oh boy, here's the this guy. Pony dragons and he's got the shield. For pony pal. Hey! That's an ancient pony artifact! Hooks off my gorge board! Mm, I gorge found board. in the desert. And hey, dude, your keepers. board's a kind of smaller than the rest yours. of the dudes. Huh, it sure looks like mine, but... I might consider racing you for it. No problem. Um, no. I mean, you. Because you know you can't win against her. <laughs> you got the spike. That garble even his is bigger than yours. On your marks. Get set. Sir! Later, dudes. Forget hang 10, we're hanging 20! And smacking everything else. Lucky break. I won? I won! Woohoo! Give up the shield, Garble! Lord Ember only commanded us to be nice to ponies. Not dragons. She never said anything about pony loving dragons. Close enough. Dragon Lord Ember commanded you to make peace with ponies. You can't very well attack. He could get her to send you into you? dust. If that's possible. I guess we'll find out. Later. Ah! Ha! Smash and grab. Why is he always hiding behind ponies? He's actually in I front of her. Hiding when I beat you down the ridge. You fell. Wow. You must be slow if all Spike had to do to win was fall down. Ooh, burn. You. That is how you burn a dragon. I'll race you back to the top. If you win, you can have your pony junk. But if I win, you'll leave and I get to give it to him. You're going to give him the pony junk? I'm sure I could beat you anyway. You know what? Not going to. With that heavy hunk of metal on your back, it'll be a snap. Huh? Oh, yeah. Thanks for the tip. See you at the top, loser! I think you just lost because you just actually really just gave them what they wanted. Later! Hey, that's mine! <laughs> you got wings? Go after them! Remember? See? Because that's what you said to them when they first showed up. Ha <laughs> ha. Sup, cattail? I didn't know you got to keep that. Just oh, remember, never my Fluttershy's here. Turn away from them, Cattail. Flash bees can get pretty aggressive. I guess that's why none of the other bayou animals can get to the water. <laughs> Pin little Wouldn't crocodiles, get in there! Sense for you to wear the mask that calms the bees. It would. If I didn't have to fly up here to move their hive. Technicality. Are you, it's still basically turning away from them. Now the other bayou creatures can get to the water without the bees feeling threatened. Yay. You know, you didn't have to help with this. I would have lent you the mask anyway. I know. <laughs> but I couldn't leave without helping. Nope. Woo! I don't think any pony can find anything in there. I wouldn't give up. Hey, Darren do. Whoa. Ew. This old blindfold was stuck in the drain. Weren't you looking for a blindfold? Oh, yeah. I was. And I guess that's not toxic at all because we're in it now. I can't believe it's in her mouth and everything. 
you know, outside of my dreams. I can't believe you're actually going through with it. What do you mean? I'm all for pushing Where'd the envelope, go? obviously, but this is pretty out there for you, Twilight. I already learned it just doesn't What's disappear. What's out there about saving the most legendary ponies of all time from a thousands-year-old prison? Well, nothing when you say it like that. Unless the most legendary ponies of all time knew what they were doing, and we shouldn't mess with it. I'm sure making Star sense from and the Starlight over here. The best they could back then, but magic has come a long way, mostly like because <laughs> of the work they did. That's true, and you did get your wings from finishing one of Star Swirl's spells. True. Exactly. But then I messed with one and nearly destroyed the universe. So, so it can go either direction. Starlight. Star Swirl the Bearded is the greatest wizard who ever lived. The chance to have him back in Equestria is worth the risk. That's good news. Otherwise, we'd have brought this shield for nothing. I hope you don't think you're the only one to find her artifact. She didn't say this that. Shovel says otherwise. Honestly, oh, you two. Not everything is a competition. To them it is, so it's all right. is by far the most attractive of the artifacts. I'm surprised the thing hasn't grown in hundreds of years. Green slime to get yours. Or may the flash be high. I think Pinky's was the worst. Let's do this. Let's do it. Takes all three. Watch it banish them to them. Instead of bringing them back. Or not. Nice catch. What? What has happened? You're back! It worked! We brought you back! To where? You and the to others have sure you came for from? over a thousand years, but I figured out how to get you home. What? Uh -oh. No, 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 no. You must undo what you've done. Oh, uh, he starts was not happy. I mean, I don't think I can. You cannot bring us back. But I did. But she did. I brought all the pillars <laughs> she back. She did. You cannot bring only the pillars back. Oh, I knew it. Freaking knew it. We didn't, we didn't plan for this. And thus, the Season 7 villain has arrived. Oh no! But we got the pillars and the elements of harmony, so we're okay. We're okay. <laughs> oh yeah, we're in the episode Your 26 now. Attempt to imprison me has failed, Star I actually worked for a long time. Oh dear. You must return us to Limbo. That's all they put to stop him. I only figured out how to bring you back. Working on it. No table of contents. Allow me. You didn't read this book from cover to cover. Oh well, it's useless now. Dang, the whole place is useless now. And the book is really Without gone. The power of Bonehenge. Your banishing spell is useless. You have studied my writings. Surely you have some other plan. Oh. No. We only work with one these days. Don't fret. When I extinguish the light and hope of this miserable world, there's no light I right now. I won't remember any of this. No! Ow! This one is almost as strong as you, Stars were. Almost. Even in my weakened state, she cannot stop the might of shadows. Uh, she's losing. Oh hi, Starlight. Her? She's not alone. Slumbers, get in there. Know this, fiend. We will not rest until we find a way to return you to limbo. Never! Your days of glory are <laughs> Starswell. Now my dark power will reign, and you six will bow to me! There's 12 of us here. Actually, there's a lot more than that. Um, where'd he go? Gone. That is the riddle we must unravel. Nice and nebula. quickly. How long have we been gone? Over a thousand years. <laughs> Gasp. Then my spell worked. Before it was meddled with. And sure. the realm has been at peace for a millennia. <laughs> we can still see you, Twilight. We did have to save everybody from Nightmare Moon and Discord and Chrysalis and King Sombra and Lord T-Rex. And there was that one time when Starlight Where'd that book come from? destroyed life as we know it. <laughs> Just <laughs> push her away. If you were truly this accomplished, we will stop the Pony of Shadows twice as fast together. We shall see. 
It is an easy thing to say you have saved the world. Mm, someone ain't convinced yet. Oh, we've saved the world, Beardo. And we can do it again. <laughs> Be that as it may, the problem of locating the Pony of Shadows remains. And this land is vast. You haven't met us yet. You need a map. Luckily, we have just the thing. In the castle. Something about this magic seems familiar. I bet it does. Oh! Did you know he can do that? No, He's we didn't. Star Swirl. He can do anything. But the map is connected to the trees. This map, and indeed this very castle, are grown from the seed we planted over a thousand years Your ago. Your seed turned into a tree, which work. produced a box, which what grew the castle. Each of us infused a crystal seed with our magic in hopes that it would grow into a force for good. We I did. want to leave something to protect the realm in our absence, but we never dreamed our gift would become so powerful. But it couldn't do it by itself. It still had to be activated you? by these decks. You know, the sparkly crystal things that grow from the tree of harmony and represent each of us? Laughter, honesty. Nice butt hug. <laughs> oh, damn, pinky personal space. They are reflections of our own elements of hope, strength, beauty, bravery, healing, and sorcery. Sure. We had no idea our small seed would bloom into the living spirit of the land. I am glad our mantles have passed to such capable ponies. More importantly, we no longer need Ponehenge to send our foe back to limbo. Now we can, we can use, use the stored magic in this tree of harmony. But doesn't a banishing spell take a lot of power? We'd have to sacrifice yes. the elements for that. Mm -hmm. they well, technically, they were already gone. Star They're stuck in the tree. I don't think the tree can survive without the elements. If it no, dies, that's why you had to give them back. Equestria will suffer. If the Pony of Shadows has his way, your land will not exist. So, unless you have a better idea... This guy isn't as good as he was made out to be. He's kind of a jerk. Our foe will seek dark places from which to draw power. So these are the places he's already hit or gonna hit? So that we may strike as soon as you find him. What are we waiting for? I like your spirit. Look at you too. This one. Sea pony etiquette isn't gonna help <laughs> no spike. They'd help us. Uh, Twilight? Maybe. Are you okay? I just unleashed ultimate evil and doomed Equestria because I was obsessed with meeting my idol. So you're perfect. Why wouldn't I be okay? Ow. You didn't know that was gonna happen. But I should have listened to you and left things alone. Now the elements of harmony will be lost to fix my mistake. Yeah, Maybe they will, but another it's way. okay. If there is, Twilight'll find it. How many times have we been through every book in this library? Yes! If the pillars can hold open the gateway to Limbo, a powerful pony can do the banishing spell herself! Do you know what this Herself. Means? It was specific. Stop carrying books. The pillars no. don't have to leave a question. You will never stop Even being a slave. We the elements, we'll have the ponies that created them, and the Pony of Shadows will be banished for good! That's great. But I was thinking of another but. way that maybe doesn't involve banishing at all. Star Swirl knew what he was doing when he cast that spell. If I, I don't think he did. Better, maybe he'll see that I take magic as seriously as he does. <laughs> Impressive. Oh, why are we in main hands? Place Star Swirl indicated on the map have changed. I bet the Pony of Shadows would have loved the ghastly caverns before a thousand years of erosion turned it into the ghastly gorge. The Appaloosian wastes That's where it came from, huh? dark and desolate. Who knew they would become such a popular square dancing destination? Nice and outfits. I get how this part of the quest used to be cast in Eternal Night, where the Pony of Shadows could draw power. It's still basically an Eternal Night with this big city. Them, oh, jeez. Hello, Pinky. Friggin' time square version of this. Next. It seems there are fewer dark corners in the realm these days. Isn't that a good thing? Yeah. True. The Pony of Shadows will have a hard time regaining power. When he rears his head, we'll be ready. With Cider. Isn't there some way to banish him without losing all of you? Oh, I wish there were. But to save our home, 
We are my book said wait. otherwise the Twilight Head. I don't think you'll have to. No. My spell isn't finished yet, but I think we can send the Pony of Shadows to Limbo without all of you having to go as well. While I appreciate your enthusiasm... You're not even gonna look at it, dude? Come on. This is hardly the time to take risks on half-baked spells. Oh, goodness. Oh. This guy can just go away. Begging your pardon, Mr. The Bearded. But Beardo. Twilight doesn't do anything halfway. Especially not magic. Seriously, she got her wings by finishing one of your spells. I think you'll you find the book is worth reading before you dismiss it out of hope. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I <laughs> could think she's got her six friends. I believe it could work. Hmm. I suppose there is a chance. But you just go sit in the corner and no let us take care of it. The villain. Piece of crap. Maybe we should try there? That sounds like a good idea. <laughs> the hollow shades. I Sounds like the perfect place to me. There. Uh, they have to be pretty distant. The hollow shades was abandoned eons ago. We don't talk about that oh, side of the cool. family. The only time the maps called all of us to one place was Starlight's village. So it's like a super villain tracker. <laughs> Again, back to that. No offense. <laughs> it's been the, <laughs> the eyebrow the race. Are trying to tell us where the Pony of Shadows is? Hmm. The Tree of Harmony acting to protect the light of the realm. Yes. Yeah. A good thought, Twilight. I will make my notes He's... on this spell. Ready you finally got recognition from the uh, biggest douche in the show. I know I'm not as experienced as all of you, but is banishment really the only option? I mean, it's been a long time. Maybe the Pony of Shadows is ready to talk? I doubt we can We've done that with every other villain except for Sombra, which we, we killed. we try. Starlight, I'm sure Star's Will and the others did try. The Pony of Shadows was not sticking up for him. reconciliation. Once a villain, always a villain. Twilight, Sunburst, would you accompany me? I wish to refine this spell for our use. Oh, Come, dear. we must prepare for the struggle ahead. Prepare for battle. Let's go. I know Star Swirl is a great wizard, but no, this whole plan seems wrong. The maps only ever sent us to solve friendship problems. Maybe Not so. Not banish somebody. The Pony of Shadows doesn't really seem like the friendship type. Honestly, we don't know anything about him. No pony. A little bit. That's not entirely true. I'm well, glad to see that thing's back in tip top shape. How'd you cure the chips? You all knew the pony of Probably Shadows that. before he became what he is now. You must have been friends, so what happened? Oh boy, here we go. The tale of our rift is a sad one. I wanna hear it. I wanna hear it. Oh hey, it's the sirens. Okay. Oh jeez, fight, fight, break, destruction. Oh, dude, that's a filly. <laughs> that's wrong her bell. Stygian was a pony like the rest of us. Stygian. Though more scholar than hero. He recognized our emerging Whoa, that world was quick. champions to defend it. Jump. Well, that was easy. He just opened a portal to the human world and just together. But he himself was just an ordinary unicorn who soon grew jealous of our abilities. Didn't look like he jealousy. He stole objects from each of us. Artifacts to use in a spell. How'd you get here so fast? Cast him out for it. We always thought to return and seek forgiveness. But the castle of the two sisters? Again, his heart was bent on revenge. Oh, gross. He dashed even my hope of saving him. If Cenebula's hope is gone, then that all is lost. But why did he steal the artifacts from Is that me? how the castle no blew up? It was an enchantment to take our powers for himself. Hmm. That looks like a lot of work. It is it, what must be done. True. And it would be best it is a lot. Not to Even though we've done it ten times. I'm sorry, Starlight, but we can't stop the talk. The stakes are too high and we have to... Banish Stygian to Limbo. I get it. Uh, who? Stygian, Stygian was the name the Pony of Shadows gave up when he turned to darkness. And I'm just trying to figure out why. 
envy. He wanted more power than he had, and that desire led him down a path from which there is no return. Again, which has never I happened know from before. Experience, that's not always true. When the map called you six to my village, it was for a friendship problem. Are you sure this is different? No, she's not, but she's Stygian gonna listen to this wants idiot. To destroy all that is good in this world. There's no way to befriend a pony like that. I guess I'm lucky your idol wasn't around when you decided to be my friend. I might have been banished to limbo too. Nice, there you go. You better recognize Twilight. I am glad we had the chance to see what has grown from our efforts so long ago. It seems a shame to harm it. A necessary sacrifice. With the element's power, we will bind the Pony of Shadows in Limbo. And thanks to Twilight, we will remain to watch over the realm ourselves. You can go with him. We won't mind. How do we use them? <laughs> we we just stand there and they glow. They work for us. The elements are attuned to you. We must use their magic in pairs. No problem. We're used to banishing evil before breakfast. And it'll be an honor to save Equestria with y'all. Yay! Let's go save it again. I really hope Twilight knows what she's doing. She doesn't. She's following a false prophet. I don't remember reading anything that said the Hollow Shades was like this. Well, it was abandoned years ago, like you the said. The so. shadows must have twisted it to his purposes. Could change in a long time. Prepare yourselves. He is here. Stygian! He's in the hole. yourself and face us! It's the only place he could be. <laughs> Jump back! Or just stand there and fall. How flutter should I last? <laughs> hey, that was a lot smaller hole you fell through. I definitely would have remembered reading about this. <laughs> Not all experiences can come from books, nerd. Welcome to the Well of Shame. Nice armor, dude. When you turned your backs on me, I discovered this place. The darkness spoke to me of a power beyond any I could have. This is the first place it happened. Listened. The shadow and I became one. Soon, all of the realm will be the same. Then all ponies will feel the despair I did when you cast me out. We did what we had to do. You tried to steal our powers. What you did to me wasn't fair, so I'm gonna make everybody suffer and feel the same thing. Selfish. Now, you will pay. You better let Still Twilight sure or Starlight handle the shields, problem? Beardo. Ready? Open the portal. Now! Just a touch and a glow, and here we go. <laughs> no! You yes. will not trap me again! Twilight, push him in! Oh, that's convenient. Just good There's timing, dude. A pony in there. When he said push him in, he didn't mean fly into him. Are you Stygian? I was, once, until my friends betrayed me. But Star Swirl says you betrayed them. And you, you wanted their believe magic. everything you hear. No, I wanted their respect. I brought them together. I planned strategy and I read all I could about the beasts we faced. I didn't have magic or strength. How'd you know about so the beast to read about him before you met him? I went to Ponehenge to make my own copies of the artifacts. With them, I thought I could be a pillar too. Oh, he can hear him. They, they can hear him. I never wanted to steal their power. But instead Realize. of and letting me help, my friends threw me out. So I became stronger than any of them. The darkness welcomed me when no pony would. And I will do what I must to protect it. This is all a misunderstanding. If the pillars knew how you felt, I'm sure they would they have do now. their backs on you. The shadow isn't who you really are. Let me help you be Stygian again. Even if my friends did still care, what makes you think you have the power to help me? Because this is Twilight. Does, oh, I wasn't this so is Starlight. From you and Twilight helped me change. If there's one pony in Equestria that can save a friendship, it's her. It's you too. I, 
three, four, five, all of them, six, seven, nine, ten. The darkness will not be stopped! Ow. That's one way to do it. Just force it. <laughs> Magical Let's lasso is cool. Twilight! Get in there, sunburst. The shadow won't let go of him. He wants to stop, but he can't do it alone. Then we must help him. There you go. Finally, he did something good. Now get in the hole. Whoa. That was cool. No, yeah, you made it. Maybe. Yeah! Oh, it felt so good to do that again. And they're still here. Power rush. Woo! Nice tackle, Pinky. They didn't disappear. Maybe because we used them for healing magic instead of banishing. Probably. Well, Good thing we didn't listen to this guy. Long ago, you needed our help, Stygian. But instead of listening, we turned our backs on you. Pride clouded my judgment. I owe you an apology. Just as bad as he was. Thank you for helping us see the errors of our ways, Twilight. It seems I never accounted for the magic of friendship. Thank you, Swirl Star. Well, what? Star Swirl. <laughs> How did you get that mixed up? <clears throat> Guess we're done. Oh, apparently a conversation can save Equestria. Starlight was right, you were Someone wrong. tells me I will be making a lot of apologies today. You better. I simply cannot believe how tall you've gotten. <laughs> well, it has been It's not nice to say to a princess. Years. Will you stay here and teach magic once again? Mm -hmm. My sister no. and I have such fond memories of your lessons. As long as you don't ask for those essays we owed you before you disappeared. <laughs> you got out of work. I'm not certain Cantalot is where I belong. The realm has grown, and I believe I'll have a look around before I settle in any one place. You can go study in the Ghastly Gorge. To see what has become of my home. I believe we all do. Then well, Rockhurst is kind of encased in occasion, rock and share now. the wisdom of your great experience with the next generation of ponies. We would be honored, but if it is wisdom you seek, look no further than your own pupil. She showed me that the power of friendship is a magical force indeed. And that in <laughs> Don't hold it together. Hold it together, Twilight. As well. It's funny. I thought meeting it's my not funny. would give me all the answers I ever wanted, but instead, I forgot what I already knew. Good thing I had a student of my own to remind me. Even teachers need reminded from time to time, I guess. Hey. Okay, that was it. That was the season seven finale. Woohoo! Oh, that was something too. That was cool. All the talk, all the stories of the legends, and finally meant something. My little pony friend. Alrighty then, that was My Little Pony Friendship is Magic Season 7, Episode 25 and 26, the Season 7 Finale! And we finally actually got an actual factual living Star Swirl the Bearded and instead of just stories of him, was which was actually not as pleasant of an experience as I was hoping it would have been. I mean, the dude's from a different time, but that was a lot of that was just so freaking unnecessary. But yeah, sure, like always, he learned his lesson in the end, and everyone's going to love him. But anyways, yeah, enough about him. We've been hearing about him and through books and mentions from season one. All the other pillars, or legends, as the main six called them, we got to hear stories about them throughout the season. And we finally got to see them in their uh, physical form and what actually happened to them. And they weren't actually just legends. They were real important ponies, like the main six themselves. 
the old equestrian version of the elements of harmony so we got them the adventure to find the artifacts and of course a villain which was actually kind of a really cool villain and like all villains got defeated at the end or reformed however you want to say it because they were kind of uh, an entity uh, taking over something else and we separated them and banished one and kept the other and i'm sure he's not evil but all in all it was really cool that uh, we got starlight to take her own experiences in this type of field and be the voice of reason here even if it took a long time to get through the important part is it did and we've been everybody benefited from it they completed their task and were able to keep the elements and the pillars in the realm which was kind of like best case scenario here so yeah that is about it i really i really enjoyed these two episodes but then again i've always enjoyed maybe it's just me but me personally i've always enjoyed the stories that go back and have explanations about the times before princess luna and celestia so that was a nice treat on top of everything they accomplished in the episode itself everyone was placed in really good roles and they played them great and on top of that i'm pretty sure we were going to get more stories individual stories about these in season eight so that is something very special to look forward to so once again thank you everybody for being here for the conclusion of season seven and not just that but the entirety of season seven itself just like the six before it was one heck of a ride and it is always a blast to see what they're going to do next and with that, I say thank you. Thank you for everyone who has been following me. Not only this time, but every time. As most of you will know before this, this was not only the season 7 finale of My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic. This is also my commentary finale as well. It has been a delightful and extremely wonderful couple of years here with you and of course the ponies that started this journey. And it is with a heavy heart that I hang up my mic. I have never been one to leave things unfinished, and with two seasons still on the horizon, there's no denying that that is exactly what I am doing. But with current situations, it is unfortunately my best and only option. But I could not leave with letting you all know that you are the reason it has gotten this far. You are the reason I have become who I am now, which in my eyes is better than who I was before and I would not change it for anything. If I had the option to go back, I would do it all over again. If you accept it, you have all earned a place in my heart forever, and I depart with zero regret. Regrets. That being said, I am still very much around. Even if I will no longer be on the commentary scene, the friends I have made and the things I have accomplished cannot be undone. I am still now and forever a very much part of the fandom. Or rather, the fandom is a very big part of me. So I will still be around on Twitter, on Discord, of which are open to any and everyone. And of course, at various conventions. So if you'd like information on that, please feel free to ask. And with that, I will continue watching the seasons until its series finale, and more than likely onto the next generation, of which, who knows, could spawn its own and new projects. So for the final time, this is Cobalt Sky signing off of My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic. Never forget who you are or of what you have learned. Keep the friendships you have made and continue to understand others, even if they don't understand you. And most importantly, work towards being the person you want to become not who you think you should become. And with that, I bid you one last final farewell. Goodbye, everybody. For now.